How long have you been playing in Las Vegas? My first show, actually, it was before 1987. I was a dancer here when I was, I think, 18, and I used to dance around um, Lincoln Continentals at the convention center at the Hilton. That was my first job. The Continental, the Comet, and the New Marquis, the Mid-Sized Martigo, and the Sexy Capri, and then there's the Cougar and the Great Mark III. More kinds of cars for more kinds of people. I still remember it. <laughs> there was an attack, a massacre here in Las Vegas this week. How will this impact, you think, uh, uh, attendance at uh, casino entertainment? You know, it's very strange. There are horrible tragedies that happen in the world, and I played here um, the night after 9-11, and I was very wary and I said I don't think this is appropriate and my husband and I talked about it with the president of the hotel and we all agreed that the one thing people needed to do was to laugh and so I acknowledged the tragedy which had to be acknowledged because it was so monumental and then went on and and I it, we, it was very cathartic to sit there and forget about it for an hour and 20 minutes. So I think laughter is something that can get you through even the toughest of times. Do you believe that, uh, that people will refrain from coming to casino shows out of fear that this might be a terror that might recur? No, I think that people will always want to have a good time and you can never let fear rule your life. <laughs>